set. Interesting enough, I mean, obviously, this is not too much of a of a contrast wow. for the Korean. I mean, he's fighting a Thai fighter. He fought a, a he fought a Thai fighter. He's fighting a Thai fighter. They're really not that different yeah. Yeah. in their approach to you know developing and, and their with their skills. So. But it almost looks as if. Schwal has walked into the wrong weight category here <laughs> because Kim is just, he could be minus 63 yeah, with that height, you know? 68, yeah, 68, yeah. For sure. Well, they dwarf the centre referee, Thomas Longy of Hungary. Straight he gets the that. action underway. He's just letting him know, you know, I'm strong, I'm here, I'm bigger than you. <laughs> he's kind of putting the yeah. pressure on straight away. And you know what, it, you know, he, he's fighting with that uh, left leg forward. He's, he obviously uses his front leg. I don't think you're going to see him go to his stomach and, and challenge that back kick anytime soon. That's a deduction. For sure. See if Thomas it's so Lonya instinctive, it. you know, I don't, I don't feel like he was, again, doing it intentionally, but you know, you're kicking on someone that's actually, you just kind of recoil your leg and they run right into it. It's unfortunate, but it, it should be a deduction. I don't think the referee's gonna give it though. No. Actually, no, right. It, it, from our, when I first thought, I thought it hit his shin. I that agreed was, with you. That was yep. underneath. I, yep. That's not a kango. I, I didn't really think straight away it was a kango, to be honest. But, um, yep, good call, Sarah. Well, we shall I called see. it after you've said <laughs> <laughs> Exactly, <laughs> retrospective. Yeah. Hindsight's a wonderful thing. Yeah. But it's going to be foresight needed here from the smaller Schwal. He's going to have to get in the pocket, as Juan Marino has said, get into that distance there and let go with the triples and doubles. He's got to be very wary yeah. of the front leg of the Korean. Yeah, yeah this is going to be a tall task, man. No pun intended. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. But uh, that, that you meant that one. Yeah. No, but the Korean athlete. I mean, there's a lot of tall athletes that don't yeah. use their their length well, and he really maintains the distance, and he just makes it a nightmare for these guys to get around. It's pretty similar to the Thai, to the Thailand athlete there. You can see he's trying to go for the head. It just it can't he, he can't get his leg up. All about managing the distance dynamic. Tries with the front leg push there as well. He's going to be on the outside looking in all the time here because Kim Tae Hyun has been aggressive. Tries to score with simple turning kicks. He is being very aggressive there. He is, isn't he? Tough. It's, yeah. that, it's that new, I'm telling you, it really is a different different uh, men's Korea team. It's it really looks, there's a noticeable difference. It's great to see, though. It's great to see them having to adapt but then still being able to win. Mm -hmm. Adapt and dominate, yeah. <laughs> exactly. But cover going to be so important, as we've alluded to all the way through here. You can see the cover of the Korean yeah. athlete there is good. I don't want to speak too soon, but Sue's doing a good job of yeah. covering right now. Yeah, yeah, I agree with yeah. you. Yeah, Sue Chai Lin, spare a thought for him. He's in an open stance. He's quite happy to draw the Korean in with that back oh, leg. There's that, that, that effort there, a little bit. That little dynamic speed, though. Yeah, no, yeah it's just good. Yep. Good to see that. Great fight. Nothing on the scoreboard, but plenty to talk about, plenty to enjoy. There's oh, the punch. Oh, great shot. punch there. Someone score uh, that, please. I enjoyed it anyway. No, it was too. good, and it's a shame they're not scoring punches like that, you know. It's Kim taking oh, off his feet there. Ooh, a little sneaky one yep. there to the, to the back. Yep, he got away, but he's lifting that guard up to block his face and just snuck underneath that front arm. Well, such are the margins here in the first round. It's only a point game. That could have been a scoring punch, but it was a scoring kick from Kim. That's unfortunate. That would have been nice that to see that unlucky, first yeah. I'm not sure if it hit the chest guard. I mean, the, the athlete was holding his arm like yeah. he may have hit his arm. But I think also as well, maybe he was in the mid-air when he hit him, so it looked more spectacular. Or don't know. Yeah, it did. It did. Yeah, Something as as nice as that should score. Yeah, that's the punch there. And people are now punching with the left hand more because they have to, you know. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's a little front leg. There's the punch. Oh, come come on, scored that. That was nice. You know, that was beautiful. Taekwondo, the art of kicking and punching, but of course, kicking is favored. But he's managed to do something that other athletes haven't been able to do against uh, Kim. He's kept it close. I mean, yeah, that's yeah. One, one zero in the first round. I mean, and it wasn't even really a, a great point. It's just kind of a little sneaky little jabbing front leg roundhouse kick. So it's making the doing. Korean work, definitely. Yep. But what is, what is a Taipei athlete going to do to score against? Well, you know, the last time, so remember, like remember when he attacked and he, and he got him a little bit with his shin? I mean, he really, ex I think he yeah. surprised exploded, him. Yeah. He exploded and he has to go deep because yeah. he can't go short yeah. and take the risk of getting countered. So, you know, I think he can exploit that, you know, kind of yeah. find the right distance and uh, he might be okay. Maybe then maybe to open up, open up after that, yeah. you know, just not just the one shot. And even borrow something from the Iranian textbook and get in close and try and lift that left sure. leg up under the guard. Ooh. Tries the head shot. 
How about after the after the Korean is done? So when the Korean first puts yeah, his foot yeah, down, yeah, then yeah. re-enter right Go there. Ahead. Go ahead. So not at the same time. Don't exchange yeah, yeah, yeah. with them. Yeah, no. but not just one though. But the strength of Kim Ti Hyun just knocking back. He's Shrin's knocking advances. off balance a yeah. little bit, and he's, he's probably struggling to get that second intention going. There's the headshot uh, attempt, and it must man. be. Why did he touch your head back? Straight off the spot. That flexibility and length. It didn't even one. look like he moved then. No. Yeah, give a Korea a good, you know, again, body, yeah. body, 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 body. And Nelson extends it, pushes his hip out, and just gets the chin. And he's also just killed 15 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> He's in the driver's seat for sure now yeah. because we know how difficult it is as a, oh. as a shorter athlete to come back from here. It's going to be tough now for the Taipei athlete. Yeah, Su Chaolin doesn't have his problems to seek, but he is a redoubtable fighter. We've seen that so far. He's going to have to use all of the explosive speed. And when you've been waiting, like, there's another punch. Another punch. Not as good as the first nah, one. Not as good. But as, as the, Chinese, the Taipei athlete, as you see him, he hasn't really done much, so you can't build on that, you know. So the Korean athlete has, doesn't have to worry about, oh, the kick's coming to the body, the kick's coming to the body, and then he can change direction. But he hasn't done any of that, so. No, there's the no movement again. Ah, oh, another. Oh. <laughs> he's <laughs> he's trying guy, that punch. Surely it can go there. I'm calling this guy Mike Tyson. <laughs> Canelo Alvarez here but, in hey, Mexico here with a little. That's true. Left hook. Change sports. Yeah, yeah. man. But he's going to have to change the scoreboard oh, because... No, 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 a little bit too high. Yeah, Kim Tae Hun asking for the video oh, replay card, though. Is that a waste of time? Uh, maybe. Perhaps? I think that would be a waste of time. Not, yeah, for my <laughs> taste, that's a waste of time. He's quite comfortable there. You know, you've got another round left. Save it for when Seven you might need him more. Round. Yeah. yeah I well, a dubious shout here, but the coaches have done a great job. But Kim Tae Hun with the length of leg, and it's not just the length of leg, it's the ability to use that length sure. of leg. Not just to stand there yeah. and, and, and look intimidating, but to have different looks. And the Korean athlete know he missed it. Like, if you watch it, he kind of gives a little fist yeah. pump, like, I missed it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, after this one, he's like, yeah. yeah. I like these punches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, look good. at that. Great attitude. But you had mentioned before, Sarah, if you're going to go down, go down doing the right things. And Definitely. at least if you're trying to pick up those punches, and as you'd mentioned, Juan, that explosiveness off the spot. There's not really that much else. There's not really much else. He he's can trying do, to spend, you know, he's, he's trying, trying to, to yeah. do what he can, you know, as well, you know, getting that first first kick in and getting inside his distance and then trying to do something else after, you know. But at 4 0, a, a, a glimmer of consolation there with the, the video replay card disappearing now for the Korean. The lightweight Koreans are all doing this like jumping front kicks, like push kicks to the face. Yeah. The man 58 lad was doing it to everybody. Yeah. You know, I think it's such a, it's like a off timey type thing. They jump up and so instinctively you think someone counters count yeah. and then boom. And then it comes yeah. out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take that one back to the gym. Yeah. <laughs> I think maybe if the Taipei is going to get the next punch, surely, third time lucky. They would hope so. Yeah, you they have to, so. they have to, surely. That's a great, that's a great change up right there. Ah. Yeah, but Kim Tae Hyun has that flexibility. Tried it again the second time, not accurate. Ah, but that one slid through, but it looked nice. It's yeah, high there, it. was a little bit of a disadvantage, wasn't yeah. it? It's going over the head. Yeah, yeah. Too, too tall. But Shu Chai Lin not out of this yet. We've seen scores change around, but it would be a really, literally, as Juan has said, a tall order because at four points down, we haven't even seen the defensive game yet of Kim Tae Hyun. We don't know what he's yeah. got on the back foot. And Shuan is going to have to try and find that out. Let's see what Taipei is going to do now. Open stance, oh, but not an open there. game. Great movement there from the Korean. Look, he's making him think, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Yeah. That's but what I love that. He's, he's winning. Well, he's making the Taipei lad think there a lot. And he's also making the referee think that he's yeah. being active. Look at body, body. Two with the front leg, one with the back leg, and then uh, yeah. just keeping him honest. I mean, I mean really confusing the, uh, the, the Taipei athlete. I mean, that was a good effort from the Taipei athlete there, a good option there. It's just yeah, we've all been a fan of Xu Chaolin's efforts, but it has been the skill and the accuracy of Kim Tae Hyun, and he's now looking as if he's beginning to enjoy it here a yeah, little bit. Yeah, he looks good now. Yeah, he's, we're really enjoying it. Xu Chao Lin, don't enjoy it too much. Yeah, no. exactly. You're spot on there, Sarah. Xu Chao Lin not giving this up without a fight. He's pushing. He's trying to spin. He's trying to double. There's 
not much else that he can do short of getting a chair and trying to smack him on the head. Things really good there, the Korean. Yeah. He really looks comfortable, you know. He doesn't look like he's switched off, he's still focused. And not he's playing happy. to the crowd, not trying to do something fancy, yeah. just no, killing he's the happy time. There. He's happy. Footwork, time and distance, the trademarks of the Korean game, but a jungle, jungle here, yeah. yeah. Beautiful footwork though, he just kind of, you know, didn't kick on the first motion, he knows he's mm -hmm. trying to trap him or spin, so he just shuffled, 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 maintaining his bounce, went out of bounds, but listen, take a Kyungo and don't give up a three, four point kick. Well, good effort from Ooh. Joe Chalin, that's just pure intensity, he knows that the game is gone, let's be honest. Yeah, he's going to have to try everything now, you yeah. know, and like you said, he might give away some more points, but 4-0 is the championship, world championship final. You've got to give it everything. Do to lose 4-0 or lose 8-0 yeah, trying? Yeah, it makes no difference. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Go out with no regrets, but a few bumps and bruises. This has been a tough, long day for these men. Kim Tae-hyun. A little bit of a knee block there from yeah. the Korean. Maybe intentional. Yeah, I agree with they you. They are very yep. good at hiding oh, it, though. Aye, of course. They're good actors, definitely. Yeah, for sure. The Iranians are a little bit more in your face. They don't <laughs> care. Say, yeah, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna foul you. I don't care. Yeah, the yeah I'm not gonna act about it. Subtle, either. you know. Yeah, sneaky. Yeah. But that's the game, though. It yeah, is for game. sure. It's part of the game. You beat the player. You beat the system. But it's been a beat down from Kim Tae Hyun. He's been looking too strong. Let's see if Chao Chu Lin has anything left in the tank here he's got 25 seconds to try and do something to try and grab I that really goal i love him to score a punch yeah even if it is four ones even for consolation just value. want a punch it looks like he's loading it up actually he's, oh no that was a good option there a little and kim to hyun straight out of the ring there oh uh, that's fantastic good, good what a way to win a world yeah. championship crown there from kim to hyun picks off the front leg counter I mean, you can't blame the Taipei no. lad there, you know. No. <laughs> you kind of knew that was going to come. To do you know? yep. He was stalking him. He was pushing him back. He was, you know, getting him out of the corner. He had to take a chance sooner or later. Perfect technique as well from Kim Tae-hyun. Beautiful. Again, you know, the footwork, you know, the distance, you know, just, you know, not not doing anything crazy, just you know, sticking with his bread and butter, yep. his front leg, and he just walked right into it. Yeah, I think they got it. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Worth the throw of the dice, though. The last, you might as well, if you've got a card, what's the point in going back into the holding area with no. it? You might as well exactly, play it. Exactly, yeah. Throw those chips on the table. Yep. All in from Chinese Taipei. And the effort of committing. Unfortunately there, Bruce Harris says no. It's a seven-point lead. Kim tae Hun, he is indeed Four seconds left. too strong, too good, too quick. Yeah, I think he's really hurt his back yeah, foot. I think so. But he is indeed 2013 Finway World Champion. That foot's going to hurt tomorrow, but he yep. can console it with that gold medal. Wonderful Three effort. Goals. Three goals for Korea. Top of the leaderboard yep. before this medal. Listen, that's a that's a really impressive uh, day for him. I mean, he really outclassed everybody. He managed the distance well, composed himself, didn't get rattled. Anytime anybody made any even made it close at all, he was able just to, to regain his form. And he had that really great match in the quarterfinal with uh, the Mexican athlete and that was you know, again 8-7 the whole crowd cheering against him and, and he pulled it out just very composed yeah. he wasn't there was not one little bit of arrogance there or no. nothing he was just so composed and relaxed and, and I think it was just on the video replay there the little dark arts have been able to do the knee block and just to push and to maneuver and cover that distance yeah. it's this, those little factors that the referees don't see it kills the clock you look busy but you're not yeah sure. exactly it's all part of the game it's not just about scoring headshots and body shots